What's up guys, welcome back to another video of Super Smash Bros. Ultimate. In this video, we're heading more north. Like, far up north we're heading. I don't know how far it's going to take us. I have no idea what the next sub area is, but before we can get to any of that, we have to go against these four spirits. Game & Watch series, Judge. The enemy favors side specials. Defeat an army of fighters. And you know what, I'm not going to lie, let me... Use a more strong, stronger spirit. Um, yeah, why not? Yes, weapon resist. Let's. This should be a, a lot easier. This should be really easy. We're going up against eight Mr. Gaming Watches. They're not tiny or nothing like that, and they're gonna use the judge move on us. So. So if this move is done correctly, it can cause a lot of damage to us. So we gotta try to take them out as quickly as we can. There we go. Oh, you messed up. Ooh, got him. Didn't think I was going to. I thought I was gonna miss by barely. Judge. I, yeah, Mr. Game & Watch is a weird character. I don't understand the whole, I don't know. I, I don't understand it, why it's called Judge. All right, um, oh cool. So it does open up section by section and there's a treasure chest. Let's get that really quick. Discut, nice. And it's an ace spirit. And it's that floor immunity. A spirit we actually need, that's awesome. I just don't get why it's in a chest, though. That's weird. Ooh. Kairu no Tami ni kan. Wa na I misspelled that bit. Mispronounced that big time. Frog and snake. Conditions, hostile assist trophies will appear. Let me... Yeah, I was going to say. Let me use a stronger spirit. Uh, Deoxys. Why not? Looks like we're going against Greninja and King K. Rule. And that was beyond easy. Frog and Snake. Nice. And I believe they're both assist trophies. Or I know the frog is. I haven't seen the snake. So that's cool. Alright, let's see what this section create. Okay, cool. And the Hidden Fighter. So let's head up. Mega Man .exe. Mega Man Battle Network series. The floor is electrified. We got a spare for that, thank gosh. Reinforcements will appear after an enemy is KO'd. So let me switch over to them. Yeah, let's do it. Ugh, I can already tell I'm not going to enjoy this. After this one's KO, then reinforcement for appear. I don't know if it'd be one or two. Hopefully it's just one. I'm not letting him get back on here. Oh, okay, that was nice. Ooh. Oh, come on, no.
Alright, I'm done messing around. There we go. <clears throat> I kind of wanted to finish him off with my final smash, but nah. I'm just done messing around at this point. Mega Man.exe. That was fun, I'm not going to lie. And yeah, it looks like the majority of the legendary spirits are in the dark realm. I know there's a few of them that we have to get, like the boss. That's going to be a difficult one, but yeah. Another legendary spirit right in the books. Rosalina Luma. All right, cool. I don't know, it's kind of weird that they're here. But, I mean, that's cool. Ready, go. And that was super easy. I actually like the battlefield stage of... The, uh, I, this, the name's forgetting. I'm forgetting the name. Uh, the Super Mario Galaxy stage. I'm really, really, really like it. Seeing all the different types of ships and planets in the background. It's really cool. Oh yeah, and Luma and Rosalina joined the battle. I completely spaced out on that when they were up on the screen. Alright, let me hit this spirit right here because the one... The third one in the middle here we already have. So, Vince. Art Academy Series. Hostile assist trophies will appear. Reinforcements will appear during the battle. And I, I could have sworn we had Vince. Maybe we did at some point. But I'm okay with comment, commentating over this battle. Ready? Go! Alright, so... Yeah, this battle was beyond easy. Vince. Yeah, we, we had him. We probably had to use him for a summon, so that's fine. This leads to a new portal. So, I'll see you guys at the end of this battle right here. So now that battle is taken care of, we can continue forward. And after a couple battles later, we are finally here at the final sub area of the dark realm. I don't want to say the final sub area of this whole game because anything can happen at this point. So, what is this new area? Mysterious dimension. Okay, uh, it's actually kind of fitting that we came here last. Who among these spirits can float in the air? Okay, so it's a question air. Um, Wait a minute, I don't have all these spirits. I have the one that the, the answer's to, so. Huh. All right, well, I guess I'll commentate over it just to see what happens. Um, let me switch up my spirits here. Pick the most powerful red primary. Because I'm thinking, will anything happen or... Will I get the other two spirits for, for free? That's what I'm wondering. That's what I'm kind of hoping. Oh yeah, this one's like terrible because they make a terrible noise after you KO them. Oof. And man, they get just shot out of the stage when you hit them. Wing pick, man. Okay, so I'm assuming I got the question correct. Okay, so it seems like I can go back and go first against the other two spirits that I already have. Since I already have yellow pick, man, let's go for purple pick, man, since I don't have him. Stamina battle. The enemy deals damage when falling. Reinfor reinforcements will appear after an enemy is KO'd. It's Tiny Donkey Kong Team. And my gosh, it seems like there's a lot. So, this is going to be kind of chaotic and hectic a little bit.
And, okay. No, I messed up there. So, all the Pikmin, pretty much... It's a certain character, stamina battle, and they're all small, and they all make a terrifying noise when you KO them. It's kind of sad and depressing, but Pikmin is a kind of a sad and depressing game in a way. Alright, let's head down over here. Let's head over to this treasure chest. Oh, okay, never mind. It takes me straight to it. Nice, 1,000 spirit points. I guess... Maybe we might get more if we answer more questions correctly. <clears throat> Which spirit is a no pawn? I have no idea what the heck that means. Nago. Tora. I don't think it's Starlo. No pawn. I feel like it has to be Xenoblade Chronicles, this one right here. Stamina battle, the enemy shield has extra durability. Let's do it. It has to be, because Nago, I have no idea. Starlo, they never revealed its, like, race or anything like that. Or its species, I should say, not race. Oh, this was easy. I mean, I know I'm using very powerful spirits on my team. But man, that was way too easy. Uh, Tora. I have no idea what uh, this character plays as in Xenoblade Chronicles. It looks like the mechanic. Um, hopefully I can get Xenoblade Chronicles for the Wii. And maybe even the sequel for the Switch. So, hopefully this is the correct answer. Not 100% sure. One way to find out. Nice. Awesome. And since we already have the other two spirits, let's just keep continuing on. There's no reason to stop and try and get them. Nice. So it looks like we're just going to keep getting spirit points because we keep answering the questions correctly. And now there's four. Which spirit is the king of twilight? Where's Zant at? Wow, all these spirits we don't have. Oh, besides the Garaham. There he is, Zant. Cool. Alright, the enemy is drying after a little while. Time battle. Only certain Pokemon will emerge from Pokeballs. That's kind of weird with Zant. Um, I'll commentate over the correct answered spirits, even though we already have them, like Zant here. Zant is the king of Twilight. It's not Ganondorf. It's not Garaham. It's not the other guy either. Very surprised we don't have Gandorf Twilight form, in my opinion. I remember for the longest time, that's what they used for Gandorf's model in Smash Brothers was Twilight form of Gandorf, or Gandorf from the Twilight Princess. Yeah, it's Zant. It has to, if it's Gandorf, I'm going to look it up because it is Zant. Zant is the king of Twilight. There we go. I know he was. It's not Ganondorf. He's not the King of Twilight. It has to be Zant. Oh, I haven't even looked at the rest of the stage because I had no idea which direction we were going in. And oh my gosh, this is going to be long. Yeah, like very, very long. Let's go against these two spirits that we don't have. Le Legend of Zelda, Ganondorf, Twilight Princess. I wish that he, that this form was just an alternate skin for Ganondorf, but I guess not. Stamina battle, the enemy has increased power when the enemy is at high damage. Alright, so this should be easy. I do like the Ocarina of Time Ganondorf, but it's just weird that they went back to it. They should have done Hyrule Warriors form of Ganondorf. I think that would have been really cool to see, in my opinion. Surprise that missed, like him trying to tag me with his sword. Ganondorf, Twilight Princess. 
I don't know, this spirit just looks weird to me. It just looks off, in my opinion. Just the way his eyes are kind of looking. He looks, like, really sad. So, it's only Ace? Wow, I didn't think it was going to be a, a Legendary, but dang. Alright, cool. Gandorf, Twilight Princess. I'm surprised it's not, a, like, a fighter spirit for him. Alright, on to the next Legend of Zelda spirit. Aga, uh, Aga Nim? Legend of Zelda series. I have no idea which game he's from. All... Uh, the enemy's magic attacks have increased power. The enemy's favors special moves. All fires reflected projectiles have increased power. All right, fantastic. I could have sworn I probably had this spirit. Maybe I use him as a summon. Or maybe I don't have him. Oh, I thought I, summon I had my final smash activated. But no, that Robin who I took out did. That was a nice combo, I'm not going to lie. Oh no, I didn't have him. Cool. No idea where he's from. To be honest, I don't really care. His spirit lo looks cool. It's kind of cartoonish. And, I mean, it is cartoonish. It's anime drawn. But uh, yeah, alright, let's continue forward. Alright, time to head up. Greninja. Okay, cool. I wouldn't expect him to be here, but he is. Ready, go! I call it Greninja Kamikaze Frog, especially when he, d he does his recovery. He just flying right into the air. The Kamikaze part, no idea where, like, where it comes from. Because he doesn't kill himself or anything like that. So, Greninja joins the battle. I'm not going to lie, I'm going to switch to him. In the next video... In the next video, we will continue on in this mysterious dimension. Probably answer more questions and see who the final boss in this area is. So, until next time, I'll see you guys tomorrow for another video of Super Smash Bros. Ultimate.